Project Search started in the mid-1990s in America at the Cincinnati Children's Hospital before spreading all over America. Project Search then came to England to help young adults with learning disabilities achieve and sustain mainstream employment. In Plymouth, four partners worked together to make Project Search the success it is today. The Old Plymouth Hospitals, NHS Trust at Derford Hospital, Serco, City College Plymouth and PLUS. It's long been recognised that there are distinct social and financial benefits to employing a diverse workforce. The Trust wants to be an employer of choice and to be able to be an employer of choice we have to have a diverse workforce. I think it enhances the service that we're offering to the community. They, if we have patients coming in with learning disabilities and they see people working here with learning disabilities, that actually makes them feel better because they can actually see that as an employer we're actually supporting the community and those people. Companies that recognise the value of managing diversity see people as individuals focusing on abilities, talent and potential. I'm Thomas Waring, an intern on Project Search, um, and I believe that just because someone has a disability doesn't mean they're not employable. They can still be a, a great asset in the workplace. Um, the way I would look at it is not am I employing a person with a, with a disability, but what is the ability of that person to actually fulfil the role that we have to carry out within the hospital. We look at the role that particular job and what responsibilities are, are entailed within that job and if the person with stroke a disability can fulfill that job why don't uh, why don't we employ them to do the job the first instinct is to say well we haven't got time to do our own jobs and not to be able to give that time to someone else but actually they've um, embraced it you know we've got somebody who's with us now who you wouldn't necessarily think they've got a disability but actually he's doing a fantastic job um, but everything we gave him to do, he just, you know, turned his hand to quite easily. He didn't need an awful lot of supervision, not any more than any new person. With patients, I was a bit apprehensive at first, because uh, Billy in particular is very quietly spoken, um, and I wondered how he'd get on. But he, patients, like, really took to him as well. You know, there was no sort of problems there. Statistics continually prove that people with learning disabilities generally have better timekeeping and attendance records than their colleagues. The absence rate for the interns has um, been a huge influence to other staff in the organisation. The majority of interns have got 100% attendance rate. Um, those that haven't have actually turned up to work and had to be sent home. Now, if you go into a, a work area, that's not always the case. By investing in the right amount of effort, people with learning disabilities can often successfully complete critical and complex tasks. The Nimbus mattresses we test. We also test the Asina syringe drivers. I must admit I was very, very apprehensive, but I have to confess uh, we didn't get any problems at all during the course of the 10 weeks, and actually at the end of it, it was immensely rewarding to have um, participated. He's an absolute joy. Um, every morning, we get to a certain point where we need patients down and I'm thinking, oh my God, what am I going to do, what am I going to do? And then he comes around the corner and he's ready to start work. Companies with diversity at heart benefit from meeting their organisational goals both efficiently and effectively. The reduction in the costs around induction, on-job training, advertising externally, those costs are, are heavily reduced. Project Search has also given us not only local recognition but national and more recently international recognition. We've actually been asked to go to America um, and promote some of the innovative work that we're doing here in Plymouth so it, it just gives you recognition it's not a tick box exercise but it gets you up there with other good employers um, across the country and nationally. I've taken them on and the best employees you could find. Um, and I would have no hesitation in recommending anybody to, uh, to look at Project Search Interns. 